currently 225 tanks, armoured cars and artillery guns in the museum. He owns all of them except for four, which are on permanent loan to us. He's bought and paid for them, everything else. Um, been here for eight years this August, and uh, we've just been steadily growing ever since we first opened. That's it in a nutshell. Fantastic, thank you. No worries. These are all bits of tracks from the tanks that you can actually buy. It's pretty cool. Well, let's head on through and check out all these big toys. As you can see just there. Get a whole heap of boards to tell you about them. Some of the weights. Bit of history on them and the size of their bullets. So many of the smaller guns here. So this one's been restored, it was absolutely shattered. Done a good restore soon, and that's what it was restored from. United States. You got tanks all down one side, and cannons down the other. Big truck with his rocket. I mean, look at how wide these things are. It's absolutely amazing how wide they are. These obviously still drive. You can see the marks on the ground when they bring them in. Look how tight their, <coughs> excuse me, their quarters are. Imagine sitting up in there, tiny little seat. That one there. It's crazy. I have to be a pretty small person to be sitting in there. Look at the size of this thing. The length on that. That would definitely shoot very long way. So this bit here, I just had a bit of a brief look at the sign. Must slap down on the ground when it's spinning around. Clears the landmines. Early 1950s. <clears throat> well, have a look at that type of vehicle. It's a weird looking one. Not sure how good these signs are coming out, but I'll try and get a few of them in. Yeah, there you go. Tiny little person to sit in there. In the steering wheel. Another US one. <clears throat> a big gun on the top there. Seats are also small in them. Crazy. I suppose they're not built for comfort, that's for sure. And if you've ever seen this movie, this is one of their props. So I'll give you a turn around and have a look. sure many of you have probably seen this movie great movie and this was their prop
pretty cool. You can turn it into a tank and it's just a shell of bits and pieces. These are some of the wheels that obviously been hit by landmines and things like that probably. Well, these metals are so thick and damage to them is just crazy. I mean, look at that being pierced straight through. And as you can see, very large amount of tanks all the way through. A couple of jeeps. And look at the size of this thing. Crazy. This place just keeps going. Old US USA truck. In the US part at the moment. This place is huge. Absolutely huge. So much history here. Highly recommend you come over here in Cairns and check this place out. I thought there'd be a couple of tanks and bits and pieces, but there is unbelievable amount of things in here. So much history, so much to tell you about all the different tanks and cannons and things like that in here a lot of the big shells and that unbelievable these tiny little ones and you get these huge ones the weight of some of these things would be crazy I mean, this is the small gun I just showed you, and that's the size of your, the shells I use. We're near the back corner now, from one of the corners. I'm just going to do a bit of a spin around to give you an idea on how much is in here. This is like two very large sheds. There's about four rows of tanks everywhere you look <laughs> some of the big ones down the bottom they're like waist height just to give you an idea look at the size of that crazy She's jumping in for a tank ride. Sorry about the wind, but can't help that at the moment. I'll try and get them as they take off.
things look like they're going so fast. He's actually doing 20 k's an hour. My little sister, what do you think about the place we're in today? Awesome, thumbs up. Where are we? <laughs> What's the name of the place? Do you remember? No, it's Australian Armory. I've forgotten already. <laughs> You're not very good. A museum, Australian Armory Museum. Australian Armory, Armory museum. museum in Cairns, in Cairns, which is right next door to the Sky <laughs> Rail. So. Come check this place out guys, it is absolutely awesome, absolutely huge, want to pay a bit extra, go and shoot a couple of guns, go for a tank ride, and come to check out all the history around us in here, it's absolutely amazing, so catch you soon. <laughs>